Mina Sai, konnichiwa, this is David. And Mina. And today I'm going to do uh, my first unboxing in a while. Um, it's been a bit, I am behind. I've had a lot of work on my plate. But um, we just got the new RG00 Quanta uh, from um, the 00 um, movie, The Awakening of the Trailblazer. Also, I've got a little bit of a throat thing going on. Um, so I'm going to open this. I'm very excited. Um, Double O is my favorite Gundam. So, um, and I have yet to, act. I don't think I actually even own a Double O Quanta. I don't think I ever we have. We built, uh, I want to say it was a SD. An SD. Yeah, I think we did have an SD of the Double O Quanta for a while, but I haven't, I haven't actually done an MG or an HG of it. Um, and there's no PG or else I would be all open that shit. <laughs> um, so anyway. This RG, I've been very excited for. Um, I, I love the RG line, and I love Double O, so this is a good, good buy. Um, and box art? Yeah, we'll talk about box art once I get this tape cut. Oh, it's shiny on the back. Yeah, the, the RG boxes are pretty shiny. Mm -hmm. So, box art here. Um, we've got our Double O's frame. This is just the standard RG frame. Um, probably updated a little bit um and it's pretty it's got its nice big sword thingy and you know the usual stickers and shit that you would grow to expect from an rg kit um yeah that sword that's so great <laughs> I, I can't wait to see this in person um yeah so let's pop this thing open without further ado or whatever okay so this is an RG, so expectations should already be pretty high as far as plastic goes, um, pieces, and that sort of thing. Um, and these are not a disappointment. These look pretty much the exact same um, color-wise as the Double O um, RG, which um, is to be expected. I don't really expect it to be significantly different because it's just an upgrade of the um, Double O to begin with. At least on the pad itself, the colors are coming through really true. Yeah, yeah, I, I think that it should be fine. Mm -hmm. um, also, we're doing this on an iPad Pro. Um, mm -hmm. I was doing it on my, my old iPhone 5, um, but this has a much better um, picture, so why not use it, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But if Apple wants to pay us, by all means. <laughs> um, recoup some of that cost right. so here's our um here's our decals they are lovely as you would expect from an rg kit mm -hmm. um and also you know mega fucking tiny um as far as these things go mm. um this is the type of decal you pretty much absolutely need to use tweezers for mm. um i i mean unless you got really tiny hands like donald trump or some shit oh, oh but i don't think he's gonna be building mini gunpla because he's a shit lord stop <sighs> Um, and I'm sorry if there are any Donald Trump fans in our viewership, and yeah, you, have been you can fuck anything. off, like, because you're a shitlord. And you don't get Gundam. Yeah, yeah, you don't understand Gundam. Um, so here you go. Here's some frame pieces. Those are kind of lovely. Um, Is that the softy kind of plastic or the hard plastic? Yeah, it's the sort of soft, um, very, like, it's got a little bit of elasticity to it, mm -hmm. um, which is nice. They don't break very easily, so and that's the, like the crazy hand thing. Yeah, they're all they're all injection molded with their joints and stuff already in there. Um, so you just kind of break them apart and then bend them into place, and they're there. It's um, they're it's magic. yeah, it's it's magic basically. It's Japanese engineering at its very best. And then it looks like it looks like this is a stand right here. This is a stand for the sword, probably, mm. um, because the sword is enormous. Um, oh, so the build might not hold the sword by itself. You know, there's no fucking way. The sword <laughs> probably weighs as much as the cut the kit itself. Mm. There's more of that great green. Yeah, yeah. It is gorgeous. Oh yeah, yeah. True it animal. really is. It's like it's it's like a pine green almost yeah. like. It's very deep. Um, yeah. But that, yeah, that sword is going to be very heavy. Um, I doubt the kit will be able to support it very well on its own. Mm -hmm. 
Um, RG kits, while usually pretty detailed, they aren't necessarily the strongest. Mm. Uh, it's why I don't think that um, Bandai will ever do the Astray's flight unit or anything like that. Or not the flight unit, but the the um, the <laughs> arms, um, the big huge sword shit. Mm. Um, just won't happen. Okay, and that blue, I really like that blue. Beautiful. Yeah, it actually looks different than this blue. I think it is. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So we got a different color of blue there. Mm -hmm. um, that's distinct. Yeah. Yeah. So that's real lovely. And we got all these little tiny pieces here. Oh my God, it looks very tiny. Um, this but is I'll... a very white white. This is not the sort of yellow white or gray white. No, 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 no. This is this is like. It would get good service at Cracker Barrel White. Oh, there you go. This is like, it doesn't erase white. Careful. Yeah, there we go. Oh, wow. And these are, um, I guess, weapon handles and things. Mm. Um, I haven't actually built a double quanta, so I'm not really familiar with the, um, the ins and outs. Like, I haven't gotten to play with one in detail. But I think that it, um, those are handles for the weapons, um, possibly joints, that sort of thing. Um, so, yeah, that's, that's the basics right there. That's most of the kit. Um, and then we've got, what is this, Gundam Cross War? Oh, it looks like a um, an iOS um, Android game. Hmm. Um, card game. Yeah, it looks like a, a collectible card game style thing. I've not heard of it. Don't really know anything about it. And then let's see, we've got the Gunpla Builders World Cup ad, advertising a really, really beautiful um, Gundam. Mark II. Yeah, an RX seventy eight two actually. Um, yeah, an RX seventy eight two. Um, clear that, you know, I, I won't win because I won't enter and <laughs> not that good. So. And then we've got our booklet here. And, I mean, this is, this is not supposed to be something revolutionary. This is just an RG. Um, it doesn't, it's not doing anything new like the Sananju that's going to be released, um, in August. We cannot wait. No, this is, this is pretty much the double O, uh, with slightly different pieces in order to make it the Quanta, but I like that. So, so I'm not expecting to be very surprised. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's that sword. It's gorgeous. David picked this up because we got our visas renewed. We're allowed to stay in Japan for another year. Yeah, just got the visa renewal, so this is my sort of um, gift to myself. Celebrated. Uh... Yeah, yeah. So, so, this is my first build in actually quite a while. Mm -hmm. I haven't built one in a couple of months. Um, so I'm going to try to get this together, try to do a review of it, get that up soon. Um, and uh, maybe we'll do some more talking videos or that sort of thing. I don't know. Um if you have any things that you would like to see, let us know. Um, but we are deep, knee deep in video game development right now. Mm. So we've been pretty busy. And um, yeah, so requests, whatever. Uh, if this is your first video or you haven't liked, subscribed, all of that jazz, please do that. Like, subscribe, drop comments, um, say hey, whatever. Um, and matane. Matane.